Welcome back to Yonder. I am Quacken Dragon, and as you can see from this swirling thing, well, ignore it for now, but <laughs> okay, we, the last time we left off, we finally fixed the Cloud Catcher, which is exciting, and I think we're almost there to the end, but I wanted to show you guys this before we close this chapter, if this is the close, I don't know. So, I wanted to show you guys this weird little circle thing I found for... It's been a while. I just, like, there's been so much to do and to show you guys, so I haven't played with it. <laughs> and, of course, I wanted to record it before I jumped in this, or attempted to, anyways. I have a feeling it's just an Easter egg, but... Let, let, let's go. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> go home! Sarah. Sheesh. Oh, jeez. Aha! Ta-da! This thing! <laughs> so, yeah, as you can see, it's from... Level Board. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But yeah, you're not supposed to be here. Am I? Actually, I don't know. I mean, it's pretty true. If you fall in there, you're it's pretty much death. Because you can only... I think so. Let me go try. <laughs> uh, but I love that they just enter these random crap in the game. It's like, oh. Because, I mean, the game is all about exploration, so obviously they're going to have some random stuff like this. But yeah. Ta-da! And last time... Okay, maybe it was just that easy. <laughs> but last time, I didn't know. I, it was probably because it was dark, and I could not see there's a ledge over here. But, yeah, I died. We're back. It's just as simple as that. Through the power of editing. Alright, now first, I'm going to show you my farm, which I guess would have been smart just to start out from there. <laughs> oh well. As you can see on the right, that's all the cats that I have yet to get. It's going to be a long journey. Hi! Oh, you don't like me. It is true, those things like... What is it called? Yeah, these guys like this. And it takes... I mean, at this point in the game, it shouldn't take too much to get it. Well, to make it. But for, like, a newbie, oh, for sure, that's gonna take forever and a thirty. But, I mean, you're not gonna be... Well... I mean, technically, you could be here pretty soon in the game. I just did all the random crap <laughs> before coming here, so... It probably is very hard if you just come straight here. And voila! My other farm here. And what do I got? Hide. Potato. Yeah. I just put all the, the trees in the game. It's very interesting. But I have them! Hello! Please don't kick me. Oh my gosh. Okay. Do you have a baby? Nope. No baby yet. <gasps> yeah, there is! Oh, it's so tiny! It's so cute! Aw. Oh, I wish you could do something with the babies, like they grow up or something like that. Right now they're kind of just there. Looking adorable, I guess. But whatever. And I have crops. And I made the, the troll guard, if you remember back to the second episode, I believe, of this series. Uh, that little weird guy. But yeah, he's my farmhand in this little farm. I figured, why not? He wanted to have his dreams come true. Ah! You're in there. I don't know why it's so adorable to see them in the actual house. <laughs> Instead of just wandering outside. Yes, I love you too. I love you. I swear. I love you more than the other one. Don't tell. But yeah, these guys just give you hide. That's all they give you. Let me make sure. Yeah. Alright. Bye, squeaky squeaks! Oh, look at that moon. I got a beautiful moon. Yeah, this game is still so beautiful. After all this time. So, I have not wandered at all over on this side. So, let us see. 
get my hammer out. Because I am destructive. Destructive, angry child. Don't think there was any... Oh, there's a chest. Shut my mouth. I'm gonna die. <laughs> also, I only have one sprite left to get. And then I'll have it all. And again, these things aren't really hard to find, really. It, you just play the game, explore it, and you eventually find them all. And I'm assuming that I'm gonna get the last one somewhere around here. But... Uh, nope. I still don't know how I got nine spotted brown cats. And when there's only supposed to be six. That is a mystery to me. <laughs> I'm getting very Legend of Zelda vibes. Okay, I'm not crazy. There's freaking loot here somewhere. Where am Where am Where is it? Tell me your secret. Alright, let's explore Hyrule over here. La 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 la. Tra la la. Oh, I can't wait to play Undertale. You gotta look at every nook and cranny. Otherwise, you'll miss something. I'm sure I'm missing things already. Uh, I can fish. I cannot go across, though. Alright. Doo -doo -doo. Let's go over here. This is where the treasure was. And it wants me to go that way anyway. And I saw that treasure. I'll come back for it. <laughs> Don't you worry. Alright. Oh my god. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> God dang it. Did you see that? We almost died. Oh, there's another. What the heck? What? What? Is that you? Okay, I'm gonna assume it's you. Good God, it's noisy. Ow! You hurt my ears. Where's that treasure? There it is. <laughs> cheese. Did all that for cheese. Frustration. Whee! That's a bad trait I have in games. I just jump off. <laughs> Without even knowing what's there. Alright, I saw that treasure. Treasure! Yeah. Ooh, coins! I really need to use my coins. Maybe there'll be something awesome over here. Oh, it's raining! Hello! Ren. I do love the rain in this game. Oh, it's so beautiful and so peaceful. And it actually looks like it should look like when it's raining. Like, look at that mist and it gets to a point where it can't hear. Like, anything but thunder. It's awesome. I love it. Hate the rain in real life, though. What's up here? Ah, uh, just a worm. I found your hole. God dang it, worm. Let me in your hole. Okay, I think I explored this side pretty well. So it's time to go up the stairs. And follow this blue circle of death. It wants me to do something. Ooh. A tower. Does someone live there? There's lights. Someone had to put these lights on. Someone had to pay those bills. Alright, come on. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. It's like a little research place. Hold on. Let me break stuff that's already not broken. No. A book on sprites. Detailing their names and what foods they like. What's this? You found a letter fragment. Awesome. Uh, yeah, that's part of the... Hold on, how you do this? Nope. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Yeah, I'm supposed to find five of those. Okay. Ooh, ah. Doodads related to studying sprites. Alrighty. So this was a research... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, nope. Let's see. That's amazing. 
Uh, the lights. Look at that! <gasps> it's a rainbow! Dude. That is beautiful. I, I love this game's, like, aesthetic and just how much detail they put into the actual world and it all makes sense. <laughs> I mean, flying via umbrella doesn't, but, you know. Whoever lives up there is like, what the heck is she doing? She's just breaking all of it. Why? Who hurt her? Uh -huh. Can I break this? I think I did. Yes. Oh. Wait. <laughs> it's like, wait. I feel the story. Well, I guess once they get the letter fragments, they'll be story. But I want to search. Oh, you. See, look at that. Look at that mist just rising because of the heat. After the rain and everything. Oh, that is awesome. Break y'all still. Medicine bottles for Merc sickness. Is that a thing? I don't remember that being a thing. A letter! A large collection of medical books and notes, all detailing Merc sickness. What's this? You found a letter fragment! Yes, I know. I saw it. With my two eyes. That's an honest worm. Just living an honest worm life. In the early game, it is it is important to break those because you get plank and all this good stuff like the seeds. I think this is where... Ooh. Ooh. A hole with nothing. Oh! Hi! A faded diary. Only the last page is leg legible. Today our child is born. Our hearts swell with new purpose and hope that they may live a wonderful life. What's this? You found a letter fragment. Yay, only two more. And by the way, I'm pretty sure I am royalty or something. That's what it's been hinting at for a while now. If that's not the case, I will be extremely surprised and disappointed. Hello? Oh. A child's faded drawings. It shows a much simpler and happier time. Um, I give an F to that unicorn on the right, but a solid, a solid B plus on the left, because that is adorable. Yes. Alright, um, hmm. Wait, what was that? Aww, a child's toy. It feels oddly familiar. I wonder why. What's this? You found a letter fragment in that? But okay, whatever. Um, <laughs> I know the top one's supposed to be, what's her name, Ar Ariel, Ariel, there we go, there, it says right there, <laughs> but that is adorable, uh, like, creepy and adorable at the same time. Creepy, because it reminds me of Slenderman, but adorable, because, I mean, apparently we knew this person or creature way, way, way long ago. Where, oh, where is the last one? Hmm. Oh, well, there's doors. Up. Oh, there's a breakable door. Smash. Uh, well, not really worth it, but whatever. <laughs> we had fun breaking things. Okay, let's go up the steps like a normal person. Ooh. Sacred. I see a barrel. I see a barrel over there. Okay, well, let's break in. Knock, knock! Ah, uh, oh, wait. Aww. <gasps> Aww. A small family portrait. The parents fawn over their baby. Aww. Dad, you had a weird beard or pipe going on over there. But that's a lie! Like, the the people in this town do not look like actual people. Like, the proportions are all wrong, and that seems like the proportions are right. So that is a lie. That's a lie memory. What's this? Oh, the letter fragment. Oh, no! How's it done exploring? 
No! God dang it. We are the king and queen of Gaimia, or Jimia. I forgot what I called it. And you are our dearest child, born of royalty. I called it, I knew, all along. With the power to see between worlds. But you were not born easily. You came into this world sick and frail. Over time, you grew even weaker still. Well, we used the cloud catcher to help heal you, drawing upon more and more of the life stream until you were made healthy and strong. Oh. Oh. I was the one. But the cloud catcher was never meant to be used this way. When it broke, it broke Jimmy as well. Now the sky is torn. The palace is trapped in murk. Ari has... Yeah, I don't know. Ari has taken you somewhere safe. But we fear it is too late for us. It is. We want you to know that we have no regrets. From the moment you were born, we knew you were someone special. No matter the price that was paid. You were worth it. Aww. Oh! After all this time... You've returned! Welcome home! Dude, I wasn't finished exploring! Oh! Oh? No! <laughs> God dang it! Really? No, there has to be more. Hold on, we're gonna wait. We're gonna wait. There has to be more. That This cannot be the end. Featuring them in each other itself. <gasps> Rick! That's awesome. Pat Ventura! Do you know Ace Ventura? <laughs> she, pff, she probably hears that a lot. Or he. Butterflies in the sky! Oh, come on! Dawn to Dust, lyrics by Stefan, and sang by Elizabeth Seroff. She has a pretty voice. Like, uh, if you haven't heard the beginning song, I'm not gonna play it, but it is so beautiful. You think this is Spencer Nirvana? Okay, come on. Like, these, you all did awesome, but I wanna see what's happening. Is this the end? Like, legitly. I mean, it doesn't feel like the end. I mean, obviously, the credits are rolling. I can see that. <laughs> but it doesn't feel like the end because the... You would think the... Aw, born under... Aw, these are the little babies! Tori the Smarpa. <laughs> but, like, the ending, like, an actual dramatic song isn't playing or anything except for, like, what we've been hearing. Oh, it's cool. It even shows the chest that I opened. Hmm. All right. You learned about your past, but what of your future? There are still places to explore, things to learn, and marvels to find. More importantly, Jimmy, I need you. You've already done so much, but there's always more to be done. What do you do now is up to you. Quest complete! <laughs> that was easy. <laughs> it kind of was. You have anything else to say? Uh -huh. Don't bother trying to trade. Uh... Okay, well, you just become boring then. Alright, well, at least I get to explore some more. Mm -hmm. Oh! Cloud Catcher. Cloud Catcher as it used to be. Well, we fixed it, so it's back to that. Anything else? Anything else? Ah! Well, <laughs> that works too. Who are you? What are you doing in my house? This is my house. My property. Get off of it. 
fine. I guess since I'm royalty, I have to do this. Oh, I missed that. <laughs> Palace in bloom painting. Huh. No, well, it's still pretty. Hi. Oh, it's you. What do you want? Ugh. Old Hurley. Mm, hello. Uh, if you're after the Master Craftsman, I'm uh, not Ugh. him. Okay, maybe I am him, but I'd rather be fishing right now, so go away. You're not going to go away, are you? <laughs> I didn't say anything. I was just standing here looking at you. All right, on with the show, I guess. Welcome. I am Heronautics. <laughs> Albert Rojo Samuel Hurlstone. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yes. Your, your name spells out harsh, which... Yeah, sure, okay. Don't bother trying to remember all that. I'm sure it's just beyond you. Just call me all Hurley. Or Harsh. Would you like to- Oh, yes! Let's do it! I suppose you want to be a master craftsman. I never understood why they called it craftsman. Women can do it just as easily. Oh, I like you now. You're my favorite person. Nah, you don't want to be a crafts a master craftsman, do you? Ah, oh, quit silence. Quick, quick, quick. Yes. You're still here, so I guess you're still determined to go through with this whole master craftsman thing, yes. Yes. Okay now. Let's see if I remember it right. Oh no. Uh, I left my dry cleaning out. Uh, this is bad. There's a person over there. Oh sorry, I got distracted. Okay, I got it. Bring me two haberdashery, two cloth, two leather stripes, and a purple dye. But only if you're interested in me, I'd rather be fishing. Okay, so haberdashery, leather, cloth, okay. I don't know why I remember that. It's gonna tell me right there. <laughs> oh! <gasps> Wait, is this? Oh, is this literally my town now? Oh! 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 Uh, uh, I'm surprised he doesn't have it. Usually when they have these quests of being a master builder or whatever, they have the trade person have all the stuff that you need for the quest. But I guess this is supposed to be harder, so... Hey, Eddie. Hey. <laughs> You've saved Jimmy, uh, thank you! No problem, random stranger. I rule this land now. Look at it. It's beautiful. I promise I will be a good, good royal person. <laughs> yes, I'm royalty with my my outfit over here, but that's fine. Don't judge me. Pretty sure they were the people here. Let's look. Let's let's like, take a ganda. Violet. Oh. oh man, that joke was so good. My side still hurt from laughing so hard. Ah, <laughs> me too. Me too. Yes, it was, it was wonderful. Not at all painful. Mm -hmm. Yep, that was all the people. Okay, well. There are my subjects. Bow to me. Old Hurley, I have everything. And as you can see, I've switched my outfit to fit my station. I mean, I, I don't get any fancier than this. <laughs> and the silver hair, I mean, come on. Mother of dragons, everyone. Hey, oh, wait. Who are you? Who are you? Talk, talk to me. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. All people are able to finally return to the old kingdom. Oh, good. Good for you. Uh, yes, I see you. I'm not blind. Ah, bow before me. Bow. You're lucky I don't have any dragons oh. with me. Oh, you got everything. Okay, well, here's a recipe for making something, I oh. guess. <laughs> You're so excited, Hurley. You should just give up, though. It's probably too hard for you. What is it? Purple canvas. Ooh. A purple canvas. 
Dude, you would go so well with my red outfit. Let us see. I need purple dye, which I have. Wait, I have everything. What are you talking about, sir? You're on crack. There you go. Hey. <laughs> I am going to... Can I wear it yet? Will you be upset if I wear it? Oh, look at that. Man, I'm so fancy. God dang it. <laughs> it won't let me. Fine, I'll wear this. And then I'll wear it. Hmm. Well, I guess you've made what I asked for, at least. Okay, you are now a master craftsman. Yay, whoopee, blah, blah. I suppose you're expecting some sort of reward. Oh, oh look at me. I'm a fancy pants master craftsman. I deserve a reward. No, but I'm your queen, so I deserve a reward. Uh. Ah, okay. Here you go, go make something. That master, woohoo! Woo 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 woo. Afternoon tea? Gold leather? Ooh. Ornate. Ooh. <laughs> ah, there you go. That's what I need to make. I already have one of those. I still don't know what to do with it. Ooh, a kick. That's food. <laughs> I like all these lavish things. Flash food. Fancy. Ooh. Butterfly. <gasps> Beautiful. Potted shrub. Okay. Blue shrub. Oh my goodness. So many goodies. Sign. I know I could just go to the tab, but this is more fun. Green shampoo. Yes. Orange shampoo. Yes. Pink. Purple. At some point, you just gotta. S oh, silver. There you go. I like silver, actually. Sh ah, short shards. Yes. Dude, how dare you push a queen? Cat totem. Ah, I need that. Drop cake stack. Oh, my goodness. Fancy. Ooh. Yes, my, my animals must be treated as royalty as well. I decree. I decree it so. I like how the things look because you have the oh, you have yeah you have these that are like stone and they're so fancy but they they it doesn't really matter it doesn't really matter your animals don't have like a like meter or anything like that so it doesn't really matter if you make the best stuff for them so it's just for your entertainment <laughs> It's like, if you want to do it. That cat totem. Alright, I'll put it this way. Yeah. There you go. Oh my god! It works! That was so fast! Dude! Wait, can I not... Can I not pick? I can harvest. I can chop down this tree. Are these just stray cats? Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, there's one. I was like, I hear more than one. Okay, well, they're, they're stray cats. That was very quick. These things are very effective, but you still have to find the ones for the lady. So it kind of sucks, but at least you get cute kittens on your farm. Oh, here's our darbo. Run, run! You're so slow, I could have killed you. Run! <laughs> I still have that there. Okie dokie. Well, I will see you in a little bit. By a little bit, I, I probably mean like an hour. <laughs> it's already been an hour. But it's gonna be awesome. Mm. Yes. Yeah. Oh, you... <laughs> okay. When I talked to her the first time, she said, 
the roast thing. The roast dinner, roast beef, I don't know what the heck it is, but she said something roast. Now she's changed her mind to the actual thing, what they like. She just hates me. She just, just hates me. I hate you too, lady. So, I did a thing. I don't know if it's gonna work or what. I kind of think I did it for no reason, but <laughs> if it works, it's gonna be cool. If not, I, I don't know. I might do another video just for it, but I, I don't know. There's just like one thing left to do <laughs> besides the cats anyways, but I'm not sure it'll be worth it. <laughs> it'd be like a two minute video <laughs> alright let's see and I looked up a guide and I think I know where the, the final sprite is so we'll do that while we wait because I want it to be dark Aha! Da 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 And... It's Drake! Surprise! You just found the best treasure ever! Me! Now we shall travel together forever and ever. Because there is nothing more valuable than friends. Yay! We did it! Well, That was it! <laughs> we have all the sprites now. That was the only one that was super hard to find. All the other ones were too bad. Alright, I gave you your children. Give me something in return. <laughs> your celestial compass shall always get you true. Really? That's one thing I haven't been doing in this series is just fishing. So I have to catch... Eh. A whole ton of fish. But I'm sure there's like a ton of them. I don't know, you don't need to though. Like in Stardew Valley, you kind of need to do some fishing. Just because there's like bundles and you get money from them. And yeah, you get money from these fish, but you don't, you don't need the money. Like, you just grow potatoes or whatever you need to grow, and you're done. Like, you don't need to do anything else for money. That's, like, a good source of income. All you need is, like, you could literally just start with the first farm and be set for the whole game. They're not gonna do it. Ah! Look! Uh, I'm gonna stand on it. That's so cool! Uh, that's so cool! Yay! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> oh, that's so cool! Uh, look at the dolls! Sorry little animals, but this is cool! <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh god. <laughs> oh, that was cool. <laughs> well, <laughs> okay, for sure put the fireworks in before darkness comes. And that will happen. But that was awesome. Oh, <gasps> and you keep it. Okay, yeah, definitely worth it then. Definitely worth the headache to put in all your farms. Oh, that would be awesome. Just to like see it shoot off randomly when you're in the area. And with that, that would be the end of Yonder. This game was really fun. Like I, I like the exploration and just the fact that the world felt like an, a legit world. Like when it was nighttime, it felt like nighttime and it rained. 
It was beautiful and it had like all this fog and you couldn't see certain parts of the land anymore because of it. It was very realistic in that way. But if this is something like, oh, you like Stardew Valley with farming aspect and just have, you want something with a, a good storyline, I wouldn't necessarily turn to this game because, you know, the storyline, I'm glad they included it just so that the game had an ending and a beginning, like a definite one. But at the same time, it was not that good. <laughs> like, you came to this island, and from the moment you set foot on the island, you pretty much know what the ending's gonna be, and when the ending's there, it's like, yeah, I knew that, but oh, okay, that's it. Okay, well. But I do, I'm glad they included it either way. And with the farming, the farming, there's only like four crops you can make. This is the potato, the red berry, the blueberry, and the herbs. And you had like more variety in your tree selection than your crops. So if you wanted something for just like, oh, this is for the farming kind of thing, then yeah, the, I would say Stardew Valley for sure. Because you get to do more stuff in there. Because I like that this is more 3D. I like that you could place the buildings or the animals wherever you want. But it's I don't know. <laughs> it's so limited, really. And it, the game is about exploration, so it's not that surprising, I suppose. But yeah, it's just a beautiful game, and I definitely recommend it to those who, who do love this sort of style visual, or who just want a good exploration game for the sake of exploration. Because <laughs> yeah, once you have the first farm, you're pretty much set to go throughout the rest of the game. You don't really need to do anymore if you don't want to. Yeah, not bad for the price tag and not bad for the amount of hours that I put into it. So thank you guys so much for being here throughout the series. And yeah, write a uh, comment down below if you want to see me play something else sort of like this or you know of something else sort of like this. And then, you know, maybe I'll play it on the channel. But thank you guys and I'll see you till next time. Bye!